Hey guys and welcome. Okay guys, um, I wanted to try and do some um, induction levitation. So I got a bunch of Litz wire. This is like 14 gauge Litz wire. I wound it around this plastic funnel, which is probably not the best idea because plastic will melt really easily when the wire heats up. But anyway, I just wanted to kind of test it out to see whether this configuration would work. And I've got about, maybe it's doubled up wire, you know, so it's probably around 10 turns of doubled up wire, 20 turns if it's not doubled up, uh, something like that. So I want to connect this to um, a standard ZVS driver and see if I can levitate pieces of aluminum. I've got some different things here. I've got some styrofoam balls that are wrapped up in aluminum. I've got a little um, piece of baking foil. And I've got a, a larger one. And I'm hoping that if I can drop them in the top of this funnel, they might at least be able to maybe levitate for a small amount of time. I know that the aluminum around the styrofoam is going to heat up and probably melt the plastic. But at least uh, we'll be able to test this to see if it works and try to um, check this out. So here goes. I got myself a variable switching power supply here. This one, you can vary the voltage from about 12 volts to about 30 volts. You don't want to really go too low on the voltage, otherwise the, um, the MOSFETs will overheat and probably blow up. So um, this is what I'm going to use. And this one's actually rated at one kilowatt. Okay, here's a test at 30 volts. Close. It gets pretty hot, so I can't do it for too long. Litzwire makes a great conductor for hot light, so I just wound up some 14 gauge doubled up Litzwire here, connected it to the ZVS driver. I'm going to use a 30 volt power supply. I'm going to see if I can heat up this uh, water in the bottom of this metal cup. So let's try this right now. 